Nearly a month after his South Pasadena boy vanished, detectives are back in the park where the five-year-old was last seen. And thanks to a tip, an intense search is happening right now at Arroyo Seco Park. KCAL 9's Jasmine Veal was there as police used a new tool they hope will help find Aramad Andresian Jr. You can see the large search operation that is still underway behind me. The coroner investigator has arrived, but authorities say he is only here to assist with some specialized tools and stand by in the search for this little boy. A sheriff's drone joined officers on horseback and cadaver dogs in their search of a two mile stretch along the Arroyo Seco Canal in South Pasadena. At one point, the dogs alerted deputies to this drain. They used cameras and climbed inside to check the tunnels, even peeling back the metal plates covering a flood control channel. So we're going to use all our resources in order to make sure that's a thorough search. Lieutenant Joe Mendoza with the L.A. County Sheriff's Department says a credible tip led them back here to Arroyo Park a month after five-year-old Aramaz Adrizian Jr. went missing. Now that some time has gone by, maybe there's different scents that are available. Uh, there's other evidence that we might uncover that was uh, missed. The search also comes a day after the boy's mother made an emotional plea to the public to find her son. And to those who are concealing my son, I pray every day. The child vanished sometime overnight on April 21st after a trip to Disneyland with his father, who was found alone and unconscious in this same park next to his gasoline-covered car. Investigators have already scoured several counties and have turned up nothing. Uh, we'll be here uh, as long as it takes. This search is expected to last most of the day. The reward for any clue that leads to this boy has been increased to $20,000. Here in South Pasadena, Jasmine Veal, KCAL 9 News.